What's up everyone, this is Cybernet8610, and today we have a very special opening for you guys. We have six Heroic Champion Excalibur 10s. There was, a, uh, of course, a card shop that was uh, going out of business, unfortunately, but they had a lot of stuff for sale. And uh, so yeah, I actually got these a lot cheaper than uh, what they're marked for. I know each one of them says 20 bucks. I, I got a lot cheaper than that, because uh, I got a bunch of different 10s. And a lot of, you shouldn't let me into a, a card shop that's closing and has a big sale, because... Yeah, <laughs> I don't have a spending problem at all, I promise. <laughs> but uh, I hope you guys will enjoy this uh, huge opening we got going for you guys. It's almost like a case opening, sort of. Uh, so, yeah, th of course this is not all that I got from that sale, but that's all we're going to be opening for this opening, because it's going to be one heck of a video. So let's stop yapping and let's get started. The unfortunate thing is with these tins is that they have basically two different sets in them. You get Shockwave and uh, Overlord, I believe, are the two. I'll open up the first promo pack. I mean, I don't know if I'm sure everyone knows what's in these, but just in case there's that one person, let's open up at least the first promo pack. Alright, you have uh, Heroic Champion Excalibur, Blizzard Princess, Wind Up Rabbit, Evazor Logia, and Wind Up Zen Mains. So basically we need to end up getting Rabbit and Zen Mains out of these packs like we've done before. Put that over to the side, kinda, and uh, let's get started. Galactic Overlord. It's funny how that's possible in a lot of different tins. I can get the promos actually from the packs that are in the tin. We've done it before. Let's see if we can do it again. It's kind of a challenge now. Alright, we have Dimension Slice. Let's see. Another Galactic Overlord. You get two of those, and you, I believe you get three of Shockwave. I always thought they should have added in, you know, like, I don't know, Hidden Arsenal or something instead of having three of the same pack, but whatever. We have a Light Ray Sorcerer and a Bound Wand. <laughs> I have so many of these still. That's what's kind of funny. I, I, I don't know. I, was, I wondered before if it would have, uh, if people would have used it. So I had like a bunch of them because they were like a dollar and stuff. And uh, yeah, unfortunately not. So I have like a bunch of them. <laughs> it needs to be one of those super rares that magically goes up to like $30 or something. Can, can we please make that happen? We have a Copy Knight and a Gem Turtle. Oh, pretty cool card. I like Gym Knights, so not bad. Another super rare, of course. You guys are going to get so sick of <laughs> Overlord and Shockwave. Hopefully you don't, though. Lenvilla. See, we have a Wind-Up Knight and an Evosaur Cerato. Cerato? I think that's how you say it. Uh, yeah, ultra rare. Very nice. Especially since the Evosaurs, or Evos, whatever you want to say, uh, got their new support. So this is freaking awesome, actually. I always like this card. I always found it kind of odd that he has wings. I mean, what dinosaur that's a T-Rex has wings? Uh, whatever. I'm reading into it too much, right? They're kind of based on Digimon, so whatever. Last pack for this tin. We have Tyrant Throws. And there we go. Alright, I guess we'll just put to the side and get to the next tin. Did pretty well with that one. We got two super rares and an ultra. We need to do that with all these. <laughs> Hopefully. I don't know. Hopefully we do well. Right, promo pack. You guys already know it's in that. So we're just going to set it to the side and get to the packs. This almost feels like a 100 pack opening like we've done before. Not quite though. We have an Evo Diversity and <laughs> a Heretic, uh, Dr Heretic Sun Dragon Overlord of Helopolis. <laughs> oh man, Secret Rare. Uh, I kind of laugh because it is a tin. It has its own tin and everything too, so you can get a secret from the tin. Uh, so yeah, it's kind of funny to actually get a secret rare. Only I could do this, right? <laughs> it's kind of like last time. Heroic Champion tins uh, do that to me, I guess now. But still, it's secret from a tin, so I can't complain. It looks awesome. It does look cool, no matter. That's just kind of funny. I don't know. I just find it funny whenever you get a, especially like a secret rare card, and then of course uh, in the tin it's also a secret rare. So, Let's see, we have a uh, Insector Crossbow Z Arrow, and a Heretic Seal of Reflection for a super rare. Get a lot of the Heretic cards. Not bad. Photon Shockwave, which went to pieces. <laughs> I can't 
There we go. Come on. We can do this. There we go. So that pack just went to pieces. That means there's some awesome cards in it. Hopefully. <laughs> Alright, we have XC Territory and Ah. The XC Territory was the awesome card, I guess. Oh, it does look cool. <laughs> Evil Miracle. Right, we have a Murmur of the Forest. Last pack for this tin. A Corno. <laughs> Weird names for some of these. One day apiece. That's not bad. A Wind Up Knight. And Aw. But we did get Cigarette from that tin, so I can't complain. Let's set that over to the side. And next tin. I'm doing pretty well so far. At least, uh, I don't really want to say that, actually. <laughs> I don't want to jinx myself by saying that we're doing pretty well. I, I should just stop and not, not say that. Because <laughs> after I say that, then we're just going to get nothing but rares or something. Promo pack. Let's see. We have a uh, Photon Pelo Pearl Operative. Rare, very nice, and uh, Insector Exostag. Looks freaking awesome. I always like this one. He looks like a uh, like a Megazord or, or like a Gundam sort of thing. I don't know. He just looks really cool, I think. And, of course, a Polar Pearl Operative is just freaking awesome. Rare card. I've always been surprised that it actually ended up being a rare for us. It was a Super for Japan, so we did get a break on that card. It does happen sometimes <laughs> that we get some cards easier than Japan. Right, let's see, we have more Bouncer cards. Let's see, Phantom Bouncer and uh, Gaga Gardena and Noble Knight Artorigus. You know, that looks pretty cool, actually. I like Artorigus, so I don't mind getting one of those. Super rare, actually, from its pack, so that's pretty neat. Of course, you guys know I like Noble Knights, so... And it was a sneak preview card for that set as well. <laughs> People that are wondering. Photon Shockwave. Bunvilla. I like that card for some reason. We have a uh, Tyrant Throws and Evazor Logia. Even though it is a promo, it looks nice as an Ultra Rare. Very awesome. I like the Evazors. I'm glad they got at least uh, one new card for support. Hopefully they'll get more in the future. Hope so. always like them, of course, because they are, in a way, like Digimon. And Digimon's like one of the best things ever. It's like one, <laughs> that's like the only thing I used to watch as a kid. Just about. Wind Up Bat. Let's see. We have a DD uh, Telepon and D Boys. Uh, the ten opening is over. We just now got the best card that can possibly be in these tins. Secret rare, freaking awesome! Another secret rare. We're doing really well with these tins. They're, they're scaled, definitely scaled. <laughs> freaking awesome. And there's no, there's not a promo version of that card. So <laughs> that's even better. <laughs> All right, one day of peace. We have an Evil Sword Diplo, I guess, and uh, oh, <laughs> uh, it's Ho Oh from Pokemon. That's what that is. I, 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 there's no way I'm gonna say it right, guys. I'm sorry, but this is an awesome Spirit card. I, I've actually uh, been wanting to get another one of these because they're kind of a pain actually to find. You don't see many people uh, getting these for some reason. I don't know. Uh, but yeah, pretty cool card. I like Spirit Monsters, and that's why I'm not gonna say its name. <laughs> Out of respect for the Spirit Monsters, right? Uh, yeah, it's, it's Ho Oh. Let's just say that from Pokemon. He became a Yu-Gi-Oh card. I'm sure a lot of people will tell me how to say that right, but th th there's just no way I'll say it right. <laughs> I know my limits. Alright. Another promo pack. Anyone need any Excaliburs? <laughs> We're going to have a pretty good amount of uh, promo cards after this. Alright, let's see, Bouncer Guard. Cool archetype. Let's see, we have a Heretic Sale of Banishment. Mini Guts. Red-headed Oni. Kind of a creepy looking card, actually. <laughs> well, I say that, and that's the creepiest looking card. We have a Light Ray Sorcerer. And a uh, Heretic uh, Dragon of Geb. Looks pretty cool. Yeah, I think it's Geb is how you say it, actually. And I'm pretty sure I don't say her uh, the actual name right, like Heretic or whatever. That's just how I say it, so, yeah. Heretic, Heretic, I don't know. 
I'm sure we'll get comments about that, but that's just how I say it. That's just, that, that's just the way it's going to be, I guess. <laughs> Coming up with my own pronunciations for these, uh, for these cards makes it easier. Let's see, we have Evasor uh, Diplo. I should work for Konami and be the guy that names everything. None of the names will be complicated then. Let's see, Raw Rider. We have a DD uh, Telepon and a, a Light Serpent. Ah, it looks pretty cool, Ace. Pretty neat. I, actually, I think still actually have a pretty good amount of those uh, from older pack openings. Last pack for Shockwave on this tin. Let's see, we have Exceed Territory for our rare. Alright, put this one over to the side as well. Two more tins left. Can we get another secret rare? Let's see. Or something cool. Another Excalibur and all those different promo cards. Bouncer Guard again. Seems like that's usually the front card for some reason. Hmm. Or I've noticed it anyway. Absorbing Jar. Not a bad rare to have. <laughs> Doom Donuts. There you go. <laughs> I love cards like that. We need more cards like Doom Donuts. And Bacon Saver. It's slushy. But not that pig card or whatever. Bootin or however you say its name. I don't know. It, it scares me. It gives me nightmares. We have a uh, Gardner. see what the uh, Photon Shockwave cards will have for us. Get some Galaxy Eyes. That'd be awesome. Let's see, we have a Baby Dragon. And a, uh, let's see, uh, Lentium uh, Exarch of Dark World. Man, that's really hard to read through my camera. I was looking at it, it's just kind of, just like a blur of gold. Uh, yeah, Dark World card. Uh, looks really neat, at least. Ultra Rare. I think it's unfortunately one of those Dark Worlds you don't see being used, though. The reason I say that. Unfortunate. But it does look cool. So, it gets points for that, right? Isn't that how it works? That's how it should work. Let's see, Ivasaur Pelta. And last pack for this tin. Give us a galaxy, guys. Come on. That'd be freaking awesome. Let's see, we have a Trap Shocking Virus. And aw, no Galaxy Eyes from this tin. We do have one more to go though, so let's see. There. Try not to be too loud while I'm putting the tin, like stacking the tins up. Might hear them collapsing. An avalanche of tins, please get, please get help for me. <laughs> if you hear me getting crushed by tins. There we go. have our promo pack. Let's see, last two Overlord ten, uh, Overlord packs. Galactic Overlord. Let's see. We can get some awesome. Dimension Slice. Wattail Dragon. Yeah. Pretty cool common card at least. Another Bouncer Guard. <laughs> Again, it's usually like the front card. I don't know why. We have a uh, uh, Insector Crossbow Zeta Arrow, and again, a Heretic uh, Sun Dragon Overlord Heliopolis. Secret Rare. You know, it is freaking awesome. I, I, I will say that. But dang, it's all. Awesome. I need the. Give me the other XC monster that's a Heretic. You know, give me a Tom, because at least he's not a, a, a 10 promo where you instantly can get him. Oh well, still freaking awesome. And Doom Donuts. Well, that just made it a thousand times better. These tins, they like to troll me with getting cool secret rares, but ones that you can already get from other tins. Alright, let's see what else we have from this tin. We have DD uh, Telepon. Photon Shockwave, two more left. Well, this pack doesn't want to open. There we go. 
Icy Crevice, let's see. We have Evasaur Diplo. And the last pack. Will it have a hollow? Will it have our galaxy eyes? Let's see. I hope so. That'd be awesome. A ghost rare galaxy eyes would be nice. Well dang. This pack's gonna do the same thing. I guess we're gonna have to just do that. And there we go. Alright, now let's see what we got. Evil Miracle. Daybreaker and XZ Gift, Ultimate Rare. You know, we at least ended with a, a holo, and not only that, an Ultimate Rare. So, you know, not bad. <laughs> no Galaxy Eyes, unfortunately, though. Oh, well. those That would have been awesome, though. We still have some other tins and stuff, though, to open, though. So, uh, maybe we'll see if we can get one. But here are all the holos I got from this. I don't think we did bad, though. XZ Gift and stuff. I'm not going to name off everything, because you guys should have seen everything. I'm just going to go through them like this. We definitely did awesome, though. We got a lot of secret errors and stuff, too. A lot better, actually, than I thought we would do. So, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you for watching. Make sure to come and subscribe. And, uh, yeah, I will catch you guys later. See ya.